Hey guys, what's up? Okay, thanks for joining me tonight. I've got something super special. This is a three-tiered bath cake from Copper Cat Apothecary. So, I am actually gonna do this different. I have set up my tripod, and this might even take me two hands to put in the water, but also what are around the sides, and there were nine of them, and I've already taken a couple off, are shaving soaps, and they are, they're so cool. I've already tried one out. I wanted to try and demo one for you guys, and so what I'm gonna try and do at the end of this demo are fish these out of the water, or at least most of them, because I think they're really cool. Um, I'm gonna try and kind of demo one over the tub to kind of show you how how they lather up and how creamy they are because they really are different than just than a regular soap. So um, that's what I'm gonna try and do, which is why I'm gonna need two hands. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna try and take this off of the little card, but um, if that doesn't work, I might just have to put the whole thing in. So um, let me go ahead and see if I can do that, and then we will get this in the water, and then we will see what the shaving soap looks like. So hang on just a sec. Yay! Yay, I got it off in one piece. So I'm gonna hurry up and get it in the water. This is so big. Okay, so if you guys order one of these for her, and if I didn't say this already, she custom makes these. So you can order these on her site and she can make them for you, I'm sure, in the color that you want and definitely the scent you want. Um, so you can customize these, so that's really cool. And this one obviously is in peach. She made it for me in peach because I love peach, which was really, really sweet. So. Um, Let's go ahead and get it in the water. I can't wait. So anyway, what I was saying, what I started to say was, if you get one of these, you do not have to use the whole thing. I'm gonna use the whole thing right now and show you for demo purposes. But um, so you'll have shaving soap for days and um, you'd probably use this bath bomb um, in, in threes is what I would probably do. But anyway, we're gonna put the whole thing in and I hope this is in frame. I hope I, I've never done this before. So we're kind of, kind of testing the tripod thing out too. So let me go ahead and put it in the water. Now, I don't expect this to float because it's super heavy. Oh my gosh, it's so soft. Now, when I picked it up um, and I felt the shaving soaps and, and the bath bomb, it's just so soft. Some bath bombs they're almost, I don't want to say crumbly, but those sometimes are the best ones if they can come in one piece, and obviously this one did, um, because they're just so soft and moisturizing. I'm going to pick this up and show you guys. Ah, it's got color in it. Um, now, if you remember, because there might even be some, uh, this bottom is so, so soft. Sorry, I'm not used to being um, on the tripod in here. Um, now, you remember, she makes the, um, the butter bark. So her, her stuff is so moisturizing. So there might even be some, um, some kind of butter bark in here or maybe what she uses for that in here. So I'm gonna look at this again. This, I um, can't really see it anymore, but there was a big patch of this right here. It was really, really soft. I'm gonna start pulling these off. <laughs> this is just awesome. It looks, it totally looks like a pumpkin. It smells like really, really awesome, strong peach, <laughs> but it looks like a pumpkin. This is huge. It's huge. Okay, three more. These are awesome. These are so awesome. I was thinking, okay, well, I'll be real nice and get these to my husband. And then I tried one and I was like, whoa, yeah, he might get one. <laughs> I'll let him try one because, you know, I was going to actually order some. And then um, when this came in and it had these all over them, I was like, yay, score. And when she sells them on her site, from the ones I've seen, they're like in the little shape, shape of a little octopus which is so cute and you can actually kind of hold on to it. It's shaped like, um, 
It's shaped like um like an air hockey puck kind of. That's the best way I can describe it. Um, so you've got a little, it's kind of like you've got a handle and a little disc um, to kind of rub on you at the same time. I don't know, it's a terrible description, but um, so they just look really awesome. And I know they're really popular of hers. So this right here in the center is honestly, it's like, it's like butter. I don't know what that is and it may be some kind of butter bark. Um, I'll have to ask her. You know what? When she sees this video, she's going to comment below and she's going to say exactly what this is. It looks like peanut butter. <laughs> um, oh my gosh, this is all so soft. This is really fun. Um, but I got to know what this is. Just holding this together now. It also, when it comes to the fact that this is a cake, it's um, it's like the frosting on the inside. Holding that together too. So I'm making a, a mess. But I'm telling you what, this is a lot of fun. <laughs> it's a lot of fun too. So this is awesome. So you know, I said you can use it in threes, but you can put it in the bathtub with you and play with it like this is a lot of fun. And these colors, they're awesome. They're just perfect, perfect fall colors. Remind me of fall leaves, for sure. The wrong hand, sorry. This is just, re oops, pop the red part off. So awesome, I just was not expect, oh my gosh, I was to say, I was not expecting all these colors. Okay, now see that? I was gonna say that part might float, but oh, I don't know, that might be the frosting part. This is so awesome. This is really awesome. This is just melting all by itself. I'm not putting any pressure on it. This would be actually sort of be a really cool thing to get somebody like for um, like a birthday gift or something because you know it's a cake or any kind of occasion really. Oh, that stuff is awesome. I'm gonna let you guys see this again. It's so, it's so soft. I just did not expect this to go anywhere, <laughs> anywhere near like this, but um, I'm loving this. I'm loving this. And look at the colors. Oh my gosh, it's so bright. Y'all should see the ledge of my tub. It's just like the kids have been like getting in the, the paint. So, I mean, this, between the bath bomb and whatever, um, this, this middle frosting kind of moisturizing stuff in here is, and I should know. <laughs> if I'm doing this demo, I should know beforehand to tell you guys. Um, oh, yeah, that's, that's what you want right there. Um, I'm going to show you again. Um, and then all the shaving soaps, good grief. And then you get to customize it too. This is really, really awesome. And you know, I haven't done this. I've had this for what, like a week, 10 days, something like that. I haven't done it until now because I, was, I wasn't sure exactly how to do it. So I had to think about it for a little while. And then I was afraid I might break it getting it out of the package because I do that sometimes. And I really wanted to do it well. So I'm so glad that, um, I don't know, unless y'all think I'm making a mess of it. I'm just, I, I think that this is awesome. I'm so glad that I got it in in one piece, and it's just fabulous. So I'm glad I waited. I think that was my point. I'm glad I waited and thought about it, which things usually go better after I think about them for a little while and not, not too impulsive. Okay, that's it. That is a gorgeous, gorgeous color water. Let me get my hands rinsed off. Oh my goodness, okay, check that out. It's just a beautiful, beautiful orange. Oh, let me stand up. Oh my goodness. And we have all of our, um, 
all of our little soaps and I have some more on the counter over there. And they have some of that awesome, um, oh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna keep calling it butter, I don't know what it's called, butter, peanut butter. <laughs> um, moisturizing agent frosting, we'll have to ask her. But um, so let me get cleaned up a little bit and then I'll demo one of these on my arm. Hang on a sec. All right, look at that gorgeous water. It's so pretty, I love that color. Okay, so I have my little shaving soap and I've rinsed my hands off a good bit. So um, I've got my arm wet. I've got the one of the little pink sets of lips. So I thought about maybe adding this to my sugar scrub video and then I thought, no, it might get lost in the shovel because it's not a scrub. And I'm just, I'm not using any pressure. It's just kind of getting creamy all on its own. So it's not, um, it's not sudsy. And that's what I wanted to show you guys. It's not sudsy, it's creamy, and it's just lathery. That's awesome. I mean, you totally shave with that, totally. That's exactly what that is. So I didn't really, I mean, I believed that it was a shaving soap, but I honestly, I didn't know exactly what that meant because I hadn't experienced it myself. So now, um, you know, maybe you guys know, oh, okay, so I see exactly what that is now because, you know, I didn't know until I, I used it myself. So, but yeah, that's that's super thick. So that's not like soap at all. That's definitely like, it's like a, um, like a solid cream. So anyway, I think that's pretty cool. Um, <laughs> dropping it off, fell out of my hand. Okay, so anyway, you get the point. So um, I'm gonna rinse this off and then we'll look at the bubbles with this bath ball. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back in the handheld position because I tried to maneuver myself around my tripod to get to my jets button and that did not work because I was almost about to knock everything in the tub and that would not have been good. So let's go ahead and see what we get with the jets on. ribbons of color over here and I did read that it had mica in the um, ingredients so that's probably what that is because there was some shimmer on top so that's what that is and it looks like it's got some bubbles definitely so that's awesome it looks like my tub might be losing a little water unfortunately that happens sometimes that stinks but I'll just fill it back up a little bit. Okay, so this looks absolutely awesome. I can't wait to get in there. I know it's gonna be super moisturizing. So um, I guess I'll just be back in a few seconds for you guys and let you guys know how it was when I get out. See you in a minute. All right guys, so I'm done with my Europe Peach three tier bath cake from Copper Cat Apothecary. And we do have a little bit of cleanup left in the bathtub. Okay, so what you see down there, I looked back at the ingredients and there was mica and biodegradable glitter in there. And I'm gonna tell you, I didn't see any glitter when I first put the bath bomb in the water, but I was a little bit busy, obviously, um, because I did my demo a little bit differently and I was kind of in awe of what was going on in front of me, but, um, when I got in the bath, there was so much glitter. It looked to be blue to me, but if not blue, it's multicolored. Um, if I were to order this bath bomb again, if I were to customize it, I would probably leave out the glitter. Um, I think I could be wrong. I think the mica is the teeny tiny little dusty looking shiny part, um, which is the um, orange or copper looking part, and then the little chunks are the blue. Um, that's just my preference. Other than that, I do not need a body butter or a lotion. My skin feels amazing. The scent was awesome, and of course you saw the color of the water. I also would not use the whole thing again because I would just want to make it last. Um, I would at least split it in half, but you could obviously split it into thirds. I'm really, really excited about my shaving soap. I guess I'll split it in half with my husband. 
Um, but definitely, definitely go ahead and check her out and I will definitely put her coupon code on the screen for you guys as well because she does have a 15% off a special going on until the end of September. So that's awesome too. So definitely go ahead and check her out. I will have all of Copper Cat Apothecary's links listed down below. I hope you enjoyed this demo. I know it was a little bit of a departure for my usual style, but um, I hope you enjoyed it and let me know what you think down below. Thanks a lot, you guys. See you next time. Bye-bye.